Well, hi there, everybody, and good Tuesday morning to you. Meteorologist Travis Klineski here, and you know we're going to see a pretty decent day out there today. Yesterday, not too bad. We had a few of those showers in the afternoon hours. As we look at what we have on our future cast, a couple of clouds out there this morning. Future cast even showing some light rain. That's probably not even going to reach the ground if we see anything out there this morning. These clouds will give play away to plenty of sunshine as a weak area of high pressure builds in and mild. A bit breezy out there today as the winds will uh, be out of the north and the northwest at around 10 to 20 miles per hour, maybe even a little bit higher in eastern Nebraska. But overall, a pretty decent day out there with temperatures mainly in the 60s. Could be some 50s there to the northeast. Clear, cool tonight. Not too cold, though. We'll fall back into the 30s and 40s for overnight lows. But a warm front coming through is going to lead to a big boost in temperatures tomorrow. The warmest day of the year, potentially, for most of us. Sunny skies. A little breeze here yet. Winds 15 to 25 miles per hour. And with dry air in place, there's going to be a bit of a fire risk out there. Would not be surprised to see some red flag warnings issued as most of the state is already under a fire weather watch for tomorrow. So that's something to keep in mind. Look off to the north there. There's a cold front up in the Dakotas. That dives southward. For Wednesday night and that's going to cool us back but not too bad for Thursday. We're going to see a big drop but still going to be above average for your Thursday. As for the chances of moisture, I think that remains off to our north uh, on Wednesday night and a Thursday. Uh, really we don't see real good chances coming in until we head towards the weekend. As for what we have temperature wise for today, low to mid 60s up north, mainly sunny conditions. North and northwest winds 10 to 20 miles per hour. Mid to even upper 60s back towards the west. Again, I think we'll see some uh, plenty of sunshine after a few morning clouds. Lower to mid 60s across the south for, the sa or for today. And out towards the east, lower 60s. Winds may be a little bit stronger here in the eastern part of the viewing area this afternoon. Your extended forecast, temperature wise, a big jump tomorrow, 20 degree climb in temperatures. Low to mid 80s for many of us, some upper 70s up towards northern Nebraska. But a big drop coming in Thursday. Still, though, going to be a little bit above average with 66 degrees, a bit breezy. Slight chance of a shower on Thursday night, early Friday morning. I don't think that will amount to much, though. And then uh, back into the uh, low 70s on Friday, mid to possibly upper 70s on Saturday. Uh, most of our rain chances will hold off until the nighttime hours. Only about a 20% chance of a late afternoon shower or thunderstorm. A little bit better chance coming in Saturday night. And then as we head towards Sunday, that cold front bringing in the cooler air highs only in the 40s. Still a decent chance of some showers, especially in the morning. Something to keep in mind for those heading out to Palm Sunday services Sunday morning. And then uh, it looks like as that precipitation wraps up, we may mix in a little bit of light snow Sunday night. It should not amount to much of anything, though. And then heading into Monday, we dry things out, return the sunshine to the area, and try to get back into the low and mid-50s, which is still below average, but an improvement. And we'll try to work our way up as we head through uh, next week. So that is what you can expect over the next seven days. For the most part, pretty quiet weather again. Most active weather coming in for the second half of the weekend and a good stretch of some nice mild conditions out there as well. So until next time, I'm meteorologist Travis Klineski. Hope you have a great day.